All right, just caught my second one on White Rock. Today, Saturday, caught this one on a uh, Yum Craw. These uh, these craws right here. Let me uh, let me get them loose, and I'll show you the bottom one. I really like these. They're they're hard to find, but uh, let me see. Damn, he took it pretty solid there. Uh, there it is. Okay. Anyway, uh, I'll show you the fish first. <laughs> it's a nice little bass. Ah, take it easy there, guy. I'm going to let you go. Good fight on this one. i got to get a hat cam where I can get these fights. Uh, this fish fought like a lot bigger fish. All right, I'm going to do it in the same way. Put him back out here. Yeah. Swim away. <laughs> I'll show you the craw. I've been to uh, Bass Pro. I've been to uh, Cabela's and Academy. They never like they never have these. Uh, this thing actually looks like a real craw, not not in the shape of one. All right, so this is uh, this is a craw I was telling you about. You can see the detail on that sucker, and this one's kind of like a. Uh, Hell, I got the bag in my. It's like a green watermelon, kind of like a red speckle fleck looking thing. But Yum makes this, and they work real good. You swim them slow, make them look real, you know, make them look like they're uh, alive. But this one's worked real good for me, and you can see why. I mean, this how realistic they look. But most stores just don't have these. So if you come across these, I got these actually for a buck fifty Walmart, uh, blowing them out on clearance. So it's about uh, 5 o'clock, 5.07, and I've caught two bass. I've only been here about 20 minutes, maybe 25 minutes. And I'm using my Abu Garcia. Had this rod for uh, years now. And you can see it's kind of tattered. This is uh, even the real, I got this last year. It's kind of getting kind of beat up, but it's a Templar. Pfluger makes it. It's a good one. And, uh, yeah, hopefully I'll get back to you here with some more fish. It's a nice day out here. See some of the scenery. All right.